video introduction to the course hi there welcome to the course micropython for the bbc microbit my name is navin ps i am part of the instructor team at makeademy and i will be your instructor for this course i am an electronics engineer by education and i am passionate about teaching technology i have experience in teaching the latest technologies in a classroom setting to more than 2000 students section 1 getting started with micropython for the microbit in this section we will cover the following introduction to the course using the mu editor basics of micropython advanced concepts in micropython like lists dictionaries and functions micropython modules in the microbit working with a file system video introduction to the course in this video we will cover the following topics the target audience for the course course prerequisites learning outcomes and the course road map so who is the target audience for this course a hobbyist looking to learn to program the microbit in micropython a student with a basic understanding of electronics and want to use the microbit to interact with the physical world an engineer who wants to do fast prototyping of projects using the microbit a teacher looking to introduce physical computing in his or her class using micropython for the microbit if you are any of these this course is for you let us now look at the course prerequisites familiarity with the bbc microbit i would suggest that you complete makeademy's introduction to bbc microbit course before starting this by the way i'm the instructor for the above mentioned course as well basic understanding of electronics No prior knowledge in programming is required. Logical thinking. Now let us take a look at the learning outcomes of this course. By the end of this course, you will be confident in writing code in MicroPython for a variety of hardware platforms. You would learn to control all the onboard peripherals of the microbit using MicroPython. You will understand the working and interfacing of external peripherals for the microbit. You will learn the working of relays, LCD, and BMP one eighty sensor through projects. Let us now look at the course roadmap. We will first get started with MicroPython programming using the Mu editor. Next, we will work with all the onboard input and output devices. After that, we will interface external peripherals like LED sensors and speaker. Then we will create home automation projects with relay. motion detector and radio communication finally we will make a weather station with 16 by 2 lcd and bmp 180 temperature and pressure sensor you may go through the components list given in the resources to get a section by section breakdown along the links to buy them the most essential components for this course are the microbit itself and a nifty add-on called an edge connector breakout board this connector allows you to interface external peripherals on to the microbit more easily throughout the course i have provided a curated collection of resources these resources include links to complete code documents for in-depth learning blogs videos and more make sure that you go through the resources in every section all the codes and libraries are saved in a github repository They are organized section wise for ease of access to you the learner. I will now show you how to collect all the codes onto your computer. First, click the repository link given in the resources. Now, click on the clone or download button. After that, select download zip. After downloading, extract the file to get access to all the codes and libraries. So, what are you waiting for? Come, join me in this course. I'm looking forward to being your instructor and to guide you in tinkering with the microbit using MicroPython. When you complete this course, you will unlock a special bonus project. So make sure that you complete the course to be eligible for this special content. Summary. In this video, we have covered overview of the course, then the target audience and the course prerequisites. After that, the course learning outcomes and the course road map. and finally some best practices for a great learning experience in the next video 
we will learn to set up mu editor and write our first micro python program we will also explain the interface of the mu editor application